more Master of Guarding content from Cleater SV. If you guys enjoy this content, please go to his channel, sub subscribe, and like his videos. This one's called Victoria's Real Strength. Let's see it. Victoria. Is this kind of spoilers? Because technically they didn't say Victoria in the anime just yet. It's just 559. But then again, y'all have been just saying Victoria, Victoria this for since the fucking John Smith dark. So it's fine. Wait, what? Zeta and... Who is this? Looks like an elf, right? Another elf? You not tell me this is Victoria. I don't the hair color is not the same at all. But if Zeta went on a side mission with Victoria, right? Because that's what that the whole thing that was foreshadowed that Zeta and Victoria went on a side mission together. Zeta knowing Victoria here would make sense. Are they friends? They know each other before? Goddess's will? Huh? Well, actually, Victoria does kind of act like this towards Shadow in the previous episode. She's like, oh my gosh, Shadow is here. And she starts all smiling and looking at the moon in like a prayer mode. Kind of kind of had that religious kind of weird theme in there. But before that, I guess she, she, she still had that, huh? Victoria! Huh. She's a prophet? The great Pe Whoa, wait, uh, wait, Pe but, but, but the Be Beatrix is a Beatrix is a war god but god Goddess Beatrix? Huh? Damn! I don't know if I'd have seen that. But that, that, I guess, adds extra context. Damn. <laughs> she, does have a, she does have that insane yandere smile. I love her, though. She's great. And she's a little bit cold, right? She just straight up said, fuck your mom, Oriana. But basically, what I learned about what she's doing with Lord Perv Asset, maybe she deserves it, man. <laughs> Naivety. She's a bit naive. Hmm. Lack of flexibility. Yeah, it's her way or the highway. Seems like. Interesting. Beatrix lore. Sorry. Uh. Uh. Victoria lore, but also Beatrix is named after the goddess Beatrix. Huh. Crazy shit. Crazy shit. All right. Next one is called. This is what Zeta said to Sid while he had amnesia. So this is the Sid amnesia arc again. Yeah, it, oh. what do you mean? You're Alpha Kagano, right? Oh. Oh. oh, look at her ears flop down. She's, she's so shy asking this. Wait, 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 wait. You just said, you, 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 you literally just said, perfect opportunity. Maybe Shadow can help me, and then you fucking just confess. What? Everybody's making their moves. He's fine with it. What now? Okay, first, okay. Of all the designs, of all the cleavages, this middle, what do you even call this? The, it's like a middle part cleavage with, this, with a little bit of the inner side boobs. I think that is a superior cleavage. Zeta. Hmm. <laughs> Alpha figured it out, right? <laughs> okay. So the editing makes it look like Alpha figured it out. Bitch, did you just confess? Did you just do that behind my back? You know I'm Alpha Kagano, right? Alpha Sama wa leader da kedo. Boss ja nai yo ne. What? Well, technically it's Shadow, right? Cuz Delta also say boss is boss. Watashi no boss wa Shadow da ke. Zutto da yo. Wow. <sighs> 
Oh. What, why are you breathing? <laughs> I saw this without the B here, dude. I, I read this without the B here, dude. <laughs> what are you saying? Zeta versus Alpha. Who would win? 100% Alpha. But could Zeta have like a actual compete with Alpha? Maybe? Oh. What is that cute ass pose? Zeta says she exposes her cleavage to seduce Sid. That's the entire reason for this cleavage. At least they're not, at least they're like, you know, uh, shameless enough to actually admit it. You know what? That, that window boob right there, the cleavage, there is a reason for it. Yeah, it's not just random fan service, you know? It's Zeta just trying to seduce Sid. Makes sense. Watch? Watch one. Shadow mo mite ikanai? Watch, watch one. Shadow no mae de nara. Motto gambare. Training, right? We're just training? Oh, <laughs> that was sus. <laughs> that was extremely sus at the end. <laughs> okay, the next one is Sid regained his lost memories, but. So this is like after the amnesia arc is like about to end, I think. Hmm. Nah, 100% misunderstanding. He definitely had amnesia, right? Oh, of course, yeah. Uh -huh, all part of my plan. Oh, they figured it out. Wait, wait, I'm not really sure if it was a lie or not, but my understanding is that he actually did have an amnesia. And usually in this show, right, there's misunderstanding. So all the girls are now misunderstanding that Shadow's faking it. Now they're all getting all embarrassed at the things that they said, but Shadow actually still doesn't know. <laughs> Bro, every girl was trying to take advantage of the amnesia situation so hard. I don't blame them, but goddamn, I thought it was only Alpha that was like all these other girls, they fake. Uh -uh, I'm Alpha Kaganoi. Like, I'm your only lover. But every girl had their own scene in private with Sid and trying to tell him, I'm actually your boyfriend. You know, did you remember? Do you remember? <laughs> A mutual desire? Okay, okay. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Funny noise. Passionate bond. What did Epsilon do? Uh. Is she? <laughs> I love how Sid's like, hmm, really? This is posed by Epsilon saying that. <laughs> but despite my appearance, I'm actually super reserved. I don't, we don't have enough Epsilon scenes for me to understand what kind of character she really is. Well, it, it, to understand this part. Is she reserved? I don't know. Whenever she's talking with Beta, she's always like, huh, I'm competing with you for our master's lustful gaze. I want the master to gaze upon me. A passionate bond, huh? All her ears. Mm. Yeah? Okay. That that was a pretty tame one. Everyone else was like, no, I'm the only girl for you. Everyone else here is fake. And Zayda's like, oh, if, if you don't mind, if, if, if you don't mind, you know, please, please. <laughs> what did Gamma do? What did Gamma do? Hmm. 
<laughs> we didn't get to see any of the Delta scenes, but I guess Ada, Delta, and maybe some other girls didn't get a chance. But it's so funny that during the amnesia arc, everyone was trying to rhythm sit that much, man.